Hello friends, my name is Basant. So in this section, I'm going to show you how we can create the workflow using app. So uh, this is uh, my flow app. And if you see, uh, uh, I have a two option to create a flow. So there is a browser template and create from blank. So I'm using the browser template. So I'm uh, right now I'm going to create a uh, button flow. So I'm use this template. So now I have this template. Um, and this is the name of the flow so i'm going to in the delay i am specify the rather than 10 minutes i'm going to specify the 10 seconds and i make it done and so uh, manually trigger a flow this is a section i can trigger the flow manually and uh, here send a push notification so here push notification we have a various option in the manual entry we will get while we have uh, in the mobile we have this uh, gps settings enabled so we'll we, we will get the cd region and data and address so we will get this things but right now but uh, i am going to include the link here directly and the link would be http slash and i'm going to specify the yahoo.com so this is the link and press done and here in the label i am doing use yahoo so this is a simple workflow i am going to create it and check whether it is work or no and this is i have option to create a specify the next step but right now i'm just quickly specify the uh, uh, use template use template so i have created this button now i have created this button successfully i can also share this if you am going to browse if you if i'm going to click this button you will see use template now i have i'm going to create another template at the top i am click plus sign and i have option create for blank so i'm going to use the blank section and uh search the connectors so we need to specify the connector when the workflow is triggered so we have a more connector so but right now i'm going to use a scheduled connector so it will search the schedule connector and the schedule connector i'm click here and it will going to add uh rather than going to seconds i'm going to space okay so i'm going to specify the seconds and it's saying 15 every 15 seconds what it need to do and there is a condition section i'm going to use the action sorry in the action we have a separate actions are there available so if you see these are the action again so right now i'm using the notification so the same send me a notification so i'm click here and the notification title is uh, use blank template done and here i'm using the same link again right now i'm type google.com and here in the description i'm going to use google as well and press done and at the top i specify the blank template So it's done here. I'm going to create it. Now the next step would be so I just mentioned that I need to 60. So so what I need to do? I need to make it 60. So it will work. Not sorry 60. So I need to specify the 60. Make it work. So now it's done. I'm going to create a create. So done. So if you see, I got the notification. So now I have in the buttons, I have this, I'm click here. Uh, there's a problem triggering the workflow button. Please try again or later. Okay. So I'm going to refresh it and do it again. So it started. So in the activity section, you will say, okay, you will see this is triggered and reminder by workflow. And if I'm going to click here, you see, this is the Yahoo button. So again, I'm here, see here. So these are the button I'm going to click here again. So now uh, you will see uh, we have successfully uh, run the trigger 
the workflow these are the two workflow so i'm going to use sometime it's not showing the recent run so i'm going to use the use template so i'm going to run history you will see it will trigger two times uh, and the another one is a blank template i'm going to see the run history and it will run the two times again so these both workflow are running run two times so i think uh, this is uh, done from my side and guys hope you like this and please subscribe this channel and to get the latest update thank you and catch you soon bye